guys welcome or welcome back to my channel my name is Brianna and today I'm back with a swatch party video and it's been a long 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 time since I've done a swatch party video for you guys and this time it is the wine and only palette from Colourpop and yeah I'm just really excited to swatch this one for you it is one of the newer palettes from Colourpop or newish I mean Colourpop comes out with stuff all the time so I just thought this palette looked absolutely beautiful and I couldn't wait to try it and yeah show you guys what I think of it now I did do a quick eye look with some of the shades from the palette uh this video yeah the, the video for this eye look will be before this one so if you want to check it out please go and check it out um I am definitely not a makeup artist I just keep things very very simple so if you want a nice simple easy wearable look to uh do with this palette then just go and check that out so here is what the palette looks like for those of you who might not have seen it. Um, obviously the thumbnail is the palette anyway, but here is a more real to life look at it. So the first shade I'm going to swatch for you is called Blanc. And this is sort of like, I would call it a champagne-y color with some red undertones to it. Uh, wow, look at that. That's just one swipe, very rich color. So it's kind of like a um, bronzy color, actually. That's quite interesting. Cool. Next color is Sip Sip. This is a sort of a light, sort of paley color, a pale pinky, dusky pink color with some uh, sparkle in it. So there we go. A lot of the color came off early on. <laughs> Next one's called Major Chianti, and this is a matte color, um, sort of more purpley, are colored there we go a mid-range purple color I would say next one is called cast a chateau <laughs> very funny name this one's also quite richly uh, pigmented oh it's coming off as a lot more red than it looks in the pan oh that's very interesting so that looks a lot more red than it does in the pan it's got some sort of reflex to it that make it more sort of ready bronzy colored that's awesome Next one is Play to Wine or vine, red, Play to Vine. <laughs> play to Vine or Play to Wine? Play to Wine as in Play to Win. There we go. Got it. <laughs> and this one I actually have on my eyelids today. Um, it look, Once again, it looks more bronzy in the pan, but it comes off very red um, in the swatching. Oh, my goodness. So that's the to total we've got so far. So these colors actually come off a lot richer out of the pan than they do looking into the pan. Next one's Mullet Over. This is a ready kind of true burgundy color, I would say. It's a matte as well. Next one is a Vinter, and this one is a very deep burgundy kind of color. There we go. The second last one is called Mon Cherie. And this one is looking quite sort of silvery in the pan, but it's actually looking a lot more um, sort of torpy, bronzy, like a deep red bronze color out of the pan. And the last color is called Grateful. And this one is a deep uh, color with a lot of shimmer in it. Oh my goodness. So it's sort of like a deep burgundy. So it's a lot less bronzy than the other shade. Very interesting color palette. I am really liking these swatches. I think there is such a good range of colors, especially for the price of the palette as well. I think that, yeah, you are definitely getting a good range of colors with this. And I think that this is beautiful for all skin tones. Definitely leans more to the medium darker skin tones because there's a there's not really a lot of lighter shades in here. And I think ColourPop has definitely taken on a lot of feedback in terms of making palettes that suit a lot of different skin tones, which I think is very, very important. Uh, but yeah, I just love this shade palette. I just think it looks so beautiful. I am really going to get a lot of uh, wear out of this palette, I think. I just love the shades. I think they're very wearable, but you can also do them up a little bit. I get a little bit of a Christmassy vibe, especially from Play to Wine, that sort of um, red uh, sparkly color as well. So there's a lot of options with this. You could definitely 
make more nighttime looks you can make more daytime looks it's beautiful i am really enjoying using this palette so far and yeah i hope to do some more looks with it for you or at least just play around with it um, at home and just see how i go with it but yeah really excited about this one really enjoyed it so thank you so so much for watching this video i really appreciate all the support i get on this channel please stay tuned for more videos like this and until next time Take care and I hope to see you very soon. Bye for now.